So here we are at the farm. We've just finished our Sustainable Food Business Innovation Summit. And we're with our winner, Danielle Morton, who's just taken the uh, Pitch Fest competition prize as our best pitch of the day, so well done. <laughs> um, Danielle, tell us, tell us why you turned up this weekend. I really wanted to, um, I guess, help you know, people in the industry who have helped me and helped my kids gain health. And so being a part of something like this is about pushing yourself and pushing yourself out of your comfort zone. And that happened a lot today, but it was worth it. It was amazing. Um, and I have a 10 year goal now, which is I've never had before in business. Thank wow, you. Okay. And tell us what, so you had a pretty emotional day because you got a pretty, you, I mean, you started with a, a story that had an emotional connection, which you sort of shied away from a little almost, but you, when you brought that out in the end, it was pretty big for you. Is it, yeah. And that seemed to be the thing that engaged the whole room. Did you comment on that? I think, um, you know, my kids motivate me every single day and they seeing what they go through is just phenomenal and being able to help them become a healthier, happier version of themselves is so powerful. But there are moments where I still go, oh my gosh, where are we going? What are we doing? And then I just realise that we just need to keep going and there are more kids out there that need help. And mm. it's just, you know, they've had a tough start, but they are amazing. My son has a best friend, which is unheard of. We're talking about universities that he can go to now. And, mm. you know, we were talking about care for him for the rest of his life. So just life changing. And so I want to give back to the community. So cool. So what's been the, ex for the whole experience of the workshop? How would you, you know, if someone was thinking about coming along next time or if there's any value in it for them as a startup or as a you know, scale up you know, in, a, in the food game? Who's, what's, your, what's your comment or advice oh, for those who are thinking about it? It's huge. You know, um, we get caught up in the business, which you explained, and we get caught up in all those little tasks and we think we're doing the right thing. And at the end of the day, we're not actually focusing on the strategy. We're not actually getting the business moving forward. And so taking time out, as hard as it seems, it, it has moved me further forward in two days and I probably have moved in, you know, two years, really. Mm. Um, the fact that I have a 10 year goal, I could never ever set that for myself in the past. And then some amazing people that come up to me and say their children are suffering and they want advice and they want to be a part of this platform is just inspiring. So you pull those people together and put us all in a room and that is something that, you know, only you can do. <laughs> I, don't I don't know about that, but yeah, thank you. <laughs> and uh, all right, well, look, so so stoked and so proud of what you've done today. And we were going to see you pitch at Primex in a few weeks' time in May 17. Wow. Yeah, so it gets real from here on in. And my favourite prize. <laughs> <laughs> Charlie Adek, the chief. <laughs> if you're on Instagram, you follow Charlie, you'll, you'll recognise that. <laughs> it's the prize today. Danielle, well done. Thanks again. Thanks for sharing. Thank you. So,